Hello and welcome to the course on Cloudera Hadoop Administration. My name is Sijesh and this video I will show you how to disable Kerberos in a Cloudera Hadoop cluster. So you can use this link and first thing enable disable security on Zookeeper. Go to the Zookeeper, go to the configuration and search with enable security. So you can just tick and disable that. You can save this change and once this is saved you can go back to your main page and then you can go to hdfs configuration and do these steps so first so select hadoop security authentication so go to the hdfs configuration and search hadoop security authentication so that is kerberos change to simple and then save so next Hadoop security authorization copy this property and search in HDFS configuration so you can paste that Hadoop security authorization and that is selected by default you can remove that and then save so the next property is DFS data node address so that you have to change it back to 500 one zero so go to hdfs configuration select and in the search option dfs data node address change that to five double zero one zero then next dfs data node http address okay so change that to five double zero seven five so you have to change it to five double zero seven five so next data directory permission so copy that property so come back to cloudera manager and change that to 755 so save these changes and if you have hbase installed and configured and you can change these properties like hbase security authentication and hbase security authorization so you can see here in my cluster i don't have an hbase instance installed so i can skip that step so once this is done we can go ahead and restart all the services so you can see that then restart stale and redeploy client configuration so th definitely this will take some time so this has to redeploy and restart all the services you can just expand and see the status in detail so how many services are restarting all those information you can see from this page so wait here for some time to complete uh, this process so finally it will redeploy and then finish you can see now cluster is back to online so you can just use hdfs dfs ls and it's listing like and uh, uh, and uh, here you, you one more thing you need to do so you have hue and in hue there is a service called kerberos ticket renewer so if you are disabling kerberos so you can just disable uh, select that service and then delete okay so now it's deleted and you can back to the main page you can see all the services are okay now you can go to the administration security you can see here now uh, kerberos is in disabled state so earlier it was enabled and uh, so you can see all the services are given uh, except the cloudera management service which require a restart so go ahead and restart the cloudera management service okay so it take uh, some time so it has to restart all the services associated with the cloudera management service so once this is done go ahead and hit finish so you can see some uh, warning error message related to zookeeper all the service instances are up and running and uh, there is some alert associated with zookeeper service so this is zookeeper canary so you can wait some time and uh, so this will most probably this canary error will go away so if you wait for some time so that's it about uh, disabling Kerberos. With that, this concludes this demonstration.
hope you enjoyed the learning we'll see you in the next video thank you bye